Hello world, this is Random Fix and today I'm going to show you how to clear the check engine light on a 2010 Toyota Prius. This could be any third generation or even later or earlier models and pretty much everything is the same as far as the port locations. So to do this we're going to be using a very inexpensive $20 scanner and you can I'll have a link to the scanner below. Just want to show you where the port is and how to go ahead and do this. So this is on the driver's side and if we look right there that's going to be your OBD2 port. Let me go ahead and set the camera up and I'll be right back. With the vehicle off I've went ahead and I'm going to plug in the OBD2 port and if you're doing this in the dark uh, the best thing about these OBD2 ports is you could only do it one way and I plugged it in correctly and my OBD2 scanner this is not run on batteries, so it gets powers up, letting me know that I have a connection. With my foot off the brake, I'm going to go ahead and hit the power button on the Prius with the key in the car. And once all the lights turn on, it says Prius. All the check engine light, all the lights are on. Sorry, it's a very bright day here. And I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, Grab my OBD2 scanner, go ahead and hit enter. You want to have a pen and paper with you so you can write down the code and uh, look more into it. The scanner does come with the software that tells you what possibly could be. So I have two fault codes, zero pending. So I have a P102, which is and a P0123, uh, a P0. 113 and you can look up these codes on Google and type in Toyota Prius at the end of it and somebody else has the same exact problem it's already occurred and they could help you uh, as far as uh, going after the problem and pointing you in the right direction so with the scanner I can go ahead and erase the code I can check the monitors on the vehicle to see if the car is ready in case somebody's trying to sell you a lemon and they keep clearing the check engine light before the buyer comes in I'll have other videos that I'll link up to this at the end of this uh, video and I can check the VIN number on the vehicle also I can do a rescan so I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to clear it it says yes the erase is done and on these Toyotas I can just do a, a simple rescan and all the trouble codes are gone this doesn't mean you fix the issue you want to go through and uh, do a little more research right but if it was just a fluke or you left your your gas cap off uh, this will help you minimize those 80 uh, 180 dollar trips to the dealership and i'm going to go ahead and have my foot on the brake this time and i'm going to start the vehicle and my check engine light is gone and the prius is ready to be driven because it says ready right there so let me know what you guys think and give the video a thumbs up if it helped you out. Hit the subscribe button. Thank you for watching and have a great day.